everyone. So today we're going to be practicing Song for Maria, um, page 30 in Essential Elements number 116. So first we have to talk about an upbeat. An upbeat or a pickup, or if you want to sound really fancy, an anacrusis, is a note that is, or several, it can be several notes, before the first full measure of a song. So it's a partial measure, so say the song is in 4-4, four, four, like Song for Maria, and the first note of the song is actually on beat four of a measure that doesn't have any other beats in it. And that's called a pickup. The rest of that measure is actually the last measure, has those first three beats that you're missing from the first measure. So the measures come out even, but you just got that one extra pickup at the front. Okay, so when we're counting measures in this one, we're not gonna count that pickup measure as a measure. So you'll start counting from the measure after that. So we're first gonna start practicing the slurs in Song for Maria. This is our first real song with slurs in it. And so we're gonna isolate those slurs first and then we'll go back and put it together in the song. So measure two is the first measure with slurs. Take a look at your notes. We've got two slurs in a row. They're B-A-B-A. -B -A. And we're gonna make them really even slurs and we're gonna practice them. Here we go. And Okay, try it again, make them really even. Ready, and. Um, because they're eighth notes, they are gonna be a little quick in this piece. One more time, ready, and. Okay, good, so now we're gonna move on to the fourth measure, the last measure of the first line. And again, we have two slurs in a row, and it starts on A, and so everyone except the cellos, we're actually gonna start on a fourth finger A. Cellos, you're gonna start on open A like you would normally. Okay, so cellos, that means this is actually a little more difficult for you because you have to do a string crossing slur on the first one. Whereas violins and violas, we're gonna go four, three, two, one for our slur. Two sets, down for two, and then up for two. Let's give it a try, slowly first, and. Okay, same speed, let's try it again. Reset all four fingers. Make sure all your fingers start exactly where you want them so you can just lift them one at a time. Ready, and. A little faster this time. Ready, and. Same speed. One more time. Ready, and. Okay, nice job. Next measure with slurs is the second measure of the second line, also measure six. These slurs are actually the same as the slurs in measure two. So we'll practice them one more time. And again, ready? And. Okay, now we've gotten to measure seven, or the second to last measure of the piece. And we've got two sets of slur, but slurs, <laughs> but they're not in a row this time. So we're actually gonna do the notes in between them as well. So we're gonna do all of measure seven, but three notes at a time. So the first three notes, we're gonna start on G, and then slur F E, three notes. Let's try that again. One more time. Okay, now the next three notes. F and then slur D to F. Here we go. So there's a skip from F down to D and right back up again. One more time. Okay, here's all of measure seven, the whole measure from G. So we're gonna go G, F, E, F, D, F. Ready? And. One more time that measure. Okay, now the last measure. E, F, E, D. Ready? Again, that last measure. And one more time. All right, we're going back to the beginning. The whole song at a relatively slow pace. One, two, three. 